starting a business is good, but what's even better is having a consistently growing business customer base. It helps your company stay relevant and influential in the marketplace. Hi there, my name is Bumi, and on this episode, I'll be sharing with you seven working ways to helping your business customer base increase. Stay tuned! Number one, offer quality product or service. Quality product sells itself. This means that when your product is good, the demand will be high. Word of mouth sells an amazing product faster than any other form of advertising. It takes just one hand to find sugar to go ahead and call others in the nest. When the savour of your product is good, there will not just be repetitive sales on it, but referrals will also increase. Customers will tell each other about the product and those that use it will also tell others. This hereby increases your sales and the customer base. No matter how great your packaging or branding is, remember what the customer is paying for is the content. So as a business owner, you should ensure that you give customers value for their money. People want to be given the best at all times. You stand a greater chance of keeping your customers for long term when you offer them quality products regardless of the challenges you face doing so. Thank you so much for listening. I hope you learned something. On the next episode, I'll be sharing with you the second way by which we grow our customer base. Enjoy. The second way to growing your business customer base is by recommendation. Aside from the referrals your business gets from selling quality products, make it a duty to reach your satisfied clients and ask for recommendations or or reviews. They should refer your business to their sphere of contact. You can ask for the review in the format that is suitable for your business. It could be audio format, it could be video format, it could be text messages. It will go a long way to boost your sales and increase your customer base. Remember, these reviews must be honest and genuine. If you get falsified reviews, those that eventually use the product as a result of these reviews will come for your business. Thank you so much for listening. I hope you learned something today. On the next episode, I'll be sharing with you the third way to grow your business customer base. Cheers. The third way of growing your business customer base is through advertisement, and by this I mean every form of bringing the product to the awareness of the public. Advertising can be as follows. A. Have a brand ambassador. Popular or unpopular, a person who will be the face of your product to the public and educate the public about your product. B. Have business social media accounts such as Instagram, Facebook, and Twitter, etc. and engage them with content back to back. You can do this yourself or employ a social media manager or content creator. The content should not just persuade people to buy but should show them what they miss out when they are not using your product or service. Content should send sell solution of your product. Content should be educative. C. You can do online marketing such as paid online or sponsored advertisements. D. You can have a well-cultured customer service team who responds to social media inquiries and take phone calls at the speed of light. E. You can do one-on-one sales marketing. After your market segmentation is done, you can employ sales representative who will go to your customers to reach out to them with your product or service. This goes a long way to growing your business customer base. You can do other form of advertising by doing stuff such as radio jingles, billboards, e-flyers, etc. In the process of carrying out these forms of advertising, it's important to have a data bank, a place where you have the details of all your prospective clients, such as their name, their phone numbers, their email address, birthdays, home address, etc. 
as necessitated by your business. Thank you so much for listening. I hope you learned something today. Tomorrow, I'll be teaching you the fourth way to grow your business customer base. Thank you. From the previous episodes, we have learned three good ways to grow in our business customer base, which is one, offering quality products, two, requesting for recommendation, and three, advertising. The fourth way to grow in our business customer base is regularly contacting potential clients, those that we have gotten their information from every form of advertising that we have been involved with. It's time to reach out to them regularly reach out to them from time to time whether they have called to request for your products or not it's time to hit them with the phone calls visitation where necessary sending bulk sms's emails from time to time the idea of this is to put your business in their mind every time so that whenever the need for your product or service arise your brand will come to their mind first and they will immediately reach out to you Thank you guys for listening today to today's episode. I hope you learned something. Tomorrow, I'll be teaching you the fifth way to grow your business customer base. Enjoy. The fifth way to grow your business customer base is by customer reward. And by this, I mean appreciating customer loyalty to your brand. You can do this the following ways by giving percentage off on sales by giving extra goods or service on purchase by giving customers surprise treats by striking brand ambassador deals with customers you can also grant customers shares in your business etc this will go a long way to show customers how valuable they are to your business it will have an a very very high effect on sales and also customers will recommend your business to one another thank you so much for listening to this episode i hope you learned something tomorrow i'll be sharing with you the sixth valuable way to growing your business customer base enjoy The sixth way to grow your business customer base is to ensure that you are ahead of competition. You are not just up to date, but ahead. That means in factors such as pricing, system processes, product quality, technological advancement process, you are abreast. Meaning, your price must be competitive, the product or service you offer must be standard, The processes to ensuring goods or services are delivered to customers must be seamless. It should not be stressful. And also, you should be adopting different technological advancement procedures to ensuring that customers are well satisfied. When you do this as a company, you don't just attract new customers to yourself, but the old ones or the existing ones, like I like to say, will be well kept. Thank you so much for listening, guys. I hope you learned something today. Tomorrow, I'll be sharing with you the seventh and final way to ensure that your business customer base increases. Thank you so much. I'll be doing a recap of our past few episodes. We have learned six ways to grow your business customer base. The first one is offering quality products or service, giving your customer the best at all times. The second one is requesting for recommendation from satisfied clients. The third one is advertising, which is every way you are adopting to bringing your products to the face of the public. The fourth one is regularly contacting potential clients, those that you've reached out to from your forms of advertising. The fifth one is customer reward, every form of customer appreciation that you're adopting the sixth one is being up to date and ahead of competition all those that you are in business field together strategizing on how to remain relevant in the business all right so these are the six ways we've learned i'll be sharing the seventh one with us shortly the seventh way to growing your business customer base stay tuned
The seventh way to grow your business customer base is by creating professional work ethics. Remember the saying you cannot give what you don't have? Your team players or employees, also known as internal customers, are a very vital part of your organization. The kind of team you build internally as a company determines to a large extent if the potential customers reached will be converted to recurrent customers. Building in your team makes cultures that will create an enabling environment for customer relationship is very, very vital. No matter how hard working one is, if he fetches water in a basket, he will have nothing to show for it. If a business continually reaches a lot of potential clients but do, do not have customer retainership culture, the business will look like it never had customers. Some of these cultures are leadership culture, selflessness culture, ability to work under pressure, collaboration and team building, the honor culture, ownership culture, taking the business like it's theirs, customer satisfaction culture, going the extra mile, doing more than they are paid for, mind development, etc. All these and more create an enabling environment for customer relationship to thrive. When all these values are put in place, your business customer base will experience a steady growth and increase. Thank you so much for the investment of your time. I really appreciate it. I'd like you to put all you have learned to, to work and connect with me on my social media handles to share your success stories. I await them. Enjoy. This podcast was brought to you by the Ade Farayola Ulua Bumi Network. If you have any question or comment on this recording, you can leave me a voice message right here in Anchor. To do that, tap the message button. I would really love to hear what you think or the message you might have. You can also connect with me on my YouTube channel, the Ade Farayola Ulua Bumi Network, or on my social media accounts as Ade Farayola Ulua Bumi. Thank you once again. Cheers!